Alright, so I've been getting a few comments lately asking me about how did I do my uh, set production intro in my uh, videos that I did earlier uh, last year. So um, I thought I'd do a tutorial showing all of you how to do it so you can try it or just not watch it. You decide. So what you're going to want to do is to draw your image into Macromedia Flash Professional 8 is the program that I'm using. There's some latest versions, but that's the one I have. If you thought it was Sony Vegas, it's not. So let's get started. You want to go in Macromedia Flash Professional 8. It's a program I have. There's uh, latest versions, but that's the one I have. And uh, if you thought it was with Sony Vegas, it's not. So yeah you're gonna want to draw your image so I'm just gonna do a fast drawing and then we'll switch So here's my drawing and what you want to do to make the flying effect from the top in shake and then the cracks it's all steps you're gonna start by selecting the whole thing making it smaller pretty small actually you might want to zoom in so you can see it Take it and place it in the middle, the top, like this. Right here looks good. Is it good? It is good. And you will want to select the frames on the top. To select them, you want to click on it without letting it, letting it go. And drag your mouse till the, all the way to the other frame and you want to right click insert keyframe and again right click create motion tween and this technique can be used to do uh, a lot more things if you want uh, a frame to do a simple thing well you make a motion tween and it'll do it so and since you made a motion tween all you have to do is size your thing to the size that you want it to be. Now that's horrible. What happened to my drawing? Whoa. Well. Huh. Never mind what happened to the drawing. We'll just keep it simple and to view what you just did press enter see that's what we have then will come the shaking effect and we're gonna do the cracking effect at the same time since it is related what you want to start to do is you press F6 on your keyboard and this will create another keyframe with the same drawing so it's going to copy all your properties into the other keyframe and then select it and to make it shake just move it a bit to the side you want to make here a new layer you press that insert layer here and in that layer you want to start drawing on top a bunch of lines just like if the side was breaking away from the inside here one on there here we'll add another one here this one's a pre-crack 
Yeah. A few like that. And then again F6. And uh, select it all. Move it again a bit to the side. And for line tool. And select the second layer. And add more cracks to the drawing. So it's actually not hard to do this. It's just uh, a bit of takes a bit of time because you have to do it all by hand, step by step, keyframe by keyframe. I wish there was a faster way, but not in this program. You can invent a program to make this if you want. I'll be glad to try it. All right, so you go like that. So you get my my idea. Keep doing that until uh, let's say like a good seven frames. All right, so you select it all again. Make it move. Crap. Mm, first of all, select both layers by pressing control, clicking one, pressing control, and click. Keep clicking the other, right? And then you add lines again, cracking. This time you can add maybe like a crack on the side, like this. So it's up to you. Whatever you want, you can draw it. All right. So once you've done all that, well, we'll press Enter to see what it does. So here you go, it's quick, easy, not hard. And then the next step after that would be finding a sound effect or you can make it yourself in mine. I made it myself. So just a simple whistle. Didn't want to take time to try to find one. Want to make it, you know, original. Make yours original however you want it. That's great. And uh, then you'd find a small video that you put in the background. It's simple, just right. You go find a, a video here. All right, then you'd want to go get a simple video. This one, video tape to deer uh, the other day. Well, the other summer actually. And everything here should be fine. You don't really need to change any of it you can look around to uh, familiarize yourself to it but uh, it's really you don't have to we're gonna wait till this uploads okay so the video you make a new layer and you would drag it into that layer so simply on top and we'll zoom out to about 70 so we can see the whole thing and make it bigger like that and you'll drag it under so the other one fits on top enter to see what it does and for some reason it's not playing anyway that's fine so that is pretty much how you make the intro that I did in my other videos. The steps, remember, make sure you do the opening first and then at the same time, frame by frame, you make it bigger and then you add the the cracks. Because if you start, um, I'm, I mean uh, shaking, so if you start shaking it without adding the cracks, then you won't have the cracks on the next frame so you'll have to redraw them exactly how it was it'll be all screwed up so make sure that you do like that and you'll if you do that you'll be just fine so um thanks for watching uh, this video hope you enjoyed please subscribe i'd really appreciate it and uh, tell me what you think about it if you have any tutorial ideas that you'd like to know 
how to do stuff you can uh, comment on the bottom of the video and uh, yeah that's that's it for today thanks